Hello guys, this is Roshu. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are boasting and today I'm going to be telling you about some Cogni rhyming slangs. Cogni rhyming slangs are basically spoken in some parts of the country, say Australia, London and England etc. A Cogni is a kind of dialect which is used to speak coded language in which a word is replaced with a phrase that ends in a rhyming word. So for example, I can say money and I can replace this word with bread and honey. So if I say I want to have some money, I can say I want to have some bread and honey. Right. So basically, honey rhymes with the word money. So I can use bread and honey instead of money. So, yeah, you can use all these Cockney slangs and replace all this word with the rhyming phrase. So, right. Uh, what I'm about to speak now is English. <laughs> Hiya, what are you looking at? Don't move your bottle and glass and plates of meat. Keep your mince pies at the screen and your jugs of beer open because I'm gonna be speaking in the Cockney dialect. If you Adam and Eve that you can understand English, then you're probably Pete Tong because there are a lot of dicky words you still have to learn. So I'm gonna put down some links in the description so you can have a butcher's. So all my China plates, do you feel that you have just gone mad and Jeff? You can still understand everything if you use your Uncle Ned. See ya soon. Ta-da! Why the bloody hell are you? I haven't got any box bunny and I need the mass bar. All right, all right. Keep your tit for tat on. I've got to pick up the billy lids. Well, can't you get a smash and grab? Are you mutton, Jeff? I haven't got an Oxford scholar. And you didn't Bruce read the hall along. You'll have to pick up some dog food on your way home. Dog food? What's dog food rhyming slang for? I don't know that one. It's not a rhyming slam. It means dog food. You dipstick. Oh. <laughs> 